All right, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna to do something very exciting. We're going car shopping. But I'm not gonna tell you guys what car it is yet. It's probably in the title, probably in the thumbnail. I don't know. But we're gonna go check out a new Mustang today. You guys seen the previous video where I was having issues with my old Mustang. So, let's go get a new one. Let's go check it out. You two about to have a shaky hand in a second. Right, I'm just gonna hold it like this. This eye look. Or chest look right here. Yeah. A little GT Mustang. Look, Daddy. Yeah, that's good. A little 5.0 action. Yeah, there's no visible reasons why this car is that damn cheap. Besides this nick right here, that's in the door. I'm a terrible cameraman. What? I'm a terrible cameraman. Yeah. I'm just trying to point out everything you so you know, uh, so you know too. <laughs> Full disclaimer: I don't think you're actually supposed to drive your vehicle in here, but I sure did because <laughs> I I'm, I like to break the rules. So I'm a little rebel. And you got some chips in the back, so. You know these small cars and this big guy. <laughs> Why they got switches? Fuck like you didn't speak. Push start? Yep. Oh, okay. All right. It's the uh, performance pack too. So it have the oil pressure, the uh truck. Huh? Okay. Look, that the alarm was about to go off? Yeah, I thought someone was screaming about the alarm was about to go off or something. I'm about to say, uh, this is embarrassing. Damn, they ain't got no back seat. Just like the other ones. The interior is clean. It's dirty, but clean. Just like all the other ones. I like the other ones. Ooh. Wait, what the heck? You can put an SD card in there? Any, anything bad stick up there? Ooh, what if I take it out of... No, nah, I'm not going to do that. Uh, no. Damn, got a garage thing opening too? My truck got that. Oh yeah, it has the uh, garage opening thing. <laughs> Tr trunk latch right there. Right here? Or, not the trunk latch, the hood latch. <sighs> oh, and it has, bro, look, it has the, uh, the lights in the door right here. And it has lights in the couple of them. Up before right there. Oh, it does have touch inside work. Hmm. Where's the damn spare tire? Comes with working or something. Where the tire at? That's a good question. Yeah, we don't need those where we're going. <laughs> I like the color. I'm not gonna I like the color. Ooh. Oh I almost hit it on camera. So you see people, it is a 5.0. It is a GT. There you go, focus. There you go. Where's the cold air intake? It's supposed to be fast. No, that, that, this is what you want. You want it completely stock because if the stock it is, this is how you know somebody drove the car hard. The average miles per gallon and if it had any modifications on it. Damn better yet. 
Oh, the battery center deck cover. Is this engine sideways too? No. This is long ways. It's a rear wheel drive. It's only sideways. No, I thought I thought oh, okay. See I don't I don't know that. Alright. Well, let's go get home boys and ask some questions. Not a bad looking vehicle. Now I need my jacket. Now it's cold. Is this as far back this car goes? Oh wait, no, it don't. Could y'all see me whipping a Mustang? And whipping it? And whipping it? Give me one second before we go inside. Because the, the sticker price right here is higher than what I see it online. So I'm about to hear it go back online and make Screenshot it? Huh? Screenshot it? Yeah. Oh, it's touch screen. Yep. They got the big screen, got the heated and cool seats. Heated and cool. Oh yeah, right in my face. You can control the uh, thermometer from the freaking uh, screen too. I I'm pretty sure your car can do that. Hmm. Very touchy. Alright, let's not flood it. You, you can't flood it by clutch. <laughs> Look, man. Damn, I ain't drove a main one. I don't know how. Oh, I understand what you're saying. I'm tripping. Because like, when you press the clutch and the uh, fuel pump comes on. I just thought about it. Mm. Yeah, alright. 24792, alright. Okay. I got it. I mean, either way, daddy, I'm talking about it. Okay, another video, Video. I'm outroing in my car. Why? Because I keep forgetting to outro these videos. So, what happened with the gray Mustang that's in this video is I had a few problems with it. Um, like, the windshield was chipped, I had a few dings on the side, and they were simply just asking way too much for a car with the things that I had on there. Um, yeah, they were just simply asking way too much for the, like the uh, problems what was wrong with the car. It had like five owners and stuff like that. And one owner even had it for one month. So you never know like what could have been wrong with the car. So I was, I didn't want to take that risk spending that much money and you know, just jumping in a deep end of a car that I don't like really know much about because one, like one owner had it for one month. So that's, that was like a big eye opener and just, they had to replace like the pilot bearing and the transmission and stuff like that so who could have known that the, the clutch itself could have been completely obliterated without even knowing like eventually like sooner than what it should have been um so for like for that asking price that they wanted for it i literally could have got gotten a 18 or 19 premium gt with all the upgraded stuff so I'm gonna keep my options open, keep looking around. I'm gonna keep updating you guys with these type of videos on checking out Mustangs and stuff like that. So you guys will be along for the entire adventure. It may not be soon, it may be soon. Even. I don't know, it's just whatever comes around, whenever it's a good deal, I'm not gonna make a stupid purchase just cause I want the vehicle. I'm gonna be smart about it because I, you know, I really want, you know, a 15 through 2020 GT 5.0 with a manual, simple. So, I mean, I'm not going to make a stupid purchase just to get one of those. I'm going to be smart about it. I'm going to have somebody with me to tell me, heck no, that's a dumb purchase because my dad had to help me on that one with the uh, gray Mustang. It was it was within my price range with the monthly payments, but it wasn't worth how much they were asking for it. Um, I had something else I wanted to say, but I totally forgot. Hmm. So, oh, no, it was a good experience checking out the car. Really cool salesman at that dealership. I, I'm if I saw another Mustang there and I wanted to try I would have definitely bought from them because the salesman was a great person um, it was just wasn't what I was in it wasn't what I was looking for really so keeping my options open I'll keep you guys updated with all this and uh, yeah peace out